We now want to go straight to Way 31's Dave Brazelton. He's live in one of the hardest hit areas in our region, Florence. Dave, walk us through what you're seeing right now. Well, it is damage, wind and storm damage from last night. Interesting enough, we give out the weather warnings and the alerts all the time, but until most people experience this actual severe weather conditions, it's something unbelievable. Let me step out of the way and just give you an idea of what people are experiencing here this morning with down tree, power lines, transformers in the middle of the road. The winds have blown over some of the, uh, the fences and trees and emergency vehicles and our first responders are trying to shore up the damage from this area last night. The winds have damaged quite a few neighborhoods in the Shoals area here. As a matter of fact, we have some businesses that have been affected. One business, an antique shop, had an experience where their roof had blown and went traveling half the block down the street. We talked with that owner of the store, and he said it was unbelievable as he, as he sat in the store last night. Just saw the tornado warnings coming in, so I took cover in the building. And uh, about that time, you could hear the winds come in. Uh, you could hear the metal starting to pop and ripple. And the business next door, which is Bellmead Antique Mall, the entire roof came off of that building. And of course, flew across my building, damage to both buildings. Mm -hmm. But you can see it's all the way up and down the road over here. Probably one of the worst storms that I've seen, and I've been here since probably about uh, 1976. Mm. Unbelievable if you see it for yourself. Many people on Saturday mornings get out and about and go shopping, do their things, just talk with the emergency crews. They say, Please avoid the areas. If you see trees and power lines down, let the emergency officials know. But by all means, do not try to touch or move in that area because some of the lines could be energized. We're reporting live from the Shoals this morning. Dave Brazelton, Way 31 News.